Some basic tax information regarding your stocks and shares. When you sell your stocks and shares, the tax gain or loss is calculated by comparing your tax bracket uh, to the sales proceeds minus the brokerage commissions and fees, fortunately, right? But don't let the fact that you'll probably have to pay tax at some stage stop you from either buying stocks in the first place or eventually selling them. Now, I do know of one investor who had bought some shares at a low price. They then increased greatly and he wouldn't sell them because he'd have to pay tax on his gains. Well, the long and short of it was that he held on and held on too long. What happened eventually was fairly rare, but it did happen. The company struck trouble, the shares were deregistered, and he lost his entire investment, all because he didn't want to pay tax on his gains. Tax is a technical subject, so you should definitely consult an accountant, but try to get one who knows the stock investment rules as well as the tax. Do this at least when you are first starting, please, and consider talking to your stockbroker. You do have a full service stockbroker, right? because they may know an accountant that they could recommend you to. Go to www.stockinvestingprofits.com to get a free 7-part stock investing kit for beginners shipped right out to you.